Hey there, Faith Fox family. My name's Maggie. Welcome back to day five of our Everyday Faith this month on the theme of pain. And today's EDF is a scripture, so we are going to jump right on in. It comes from 2 Corinthians 1, 8 through 9, and it says, We think you ought to know, dear brothers and sisters, about the trouble we went through in the province of Asia. We were crushed and overwhelmed beyond our ability to endure, and we thought we would never live through it. In fact, we expected to die. Have you ever been so overwhelmed or so overcome by your pain that you weren't sure you would make it? Maybe it was physical pain and true, or truly a near-death experience, or maybe it was emotional pain that left you feeling debilitated and unable to move forward. This is the exact feeling the Apostle Paul experienced in his own life. In fact, the pain was so intense that he questioned whether or not he would actually live. One of Satan's many tactics against us is to make us believe that our pain is insurmountable, to cause us to fall into the belief that our pain is going to kill us. While we are not invincible and death is a reality for every person, we must remind ourselves that death has no sting and that we have victory over over all things in Christ. That comes from 1 Corinthians 15, 56 through 57. Remember here, even when your pain is overwhelming, victory is still yours. I love this, that we know the end of the story. We know that on the other side of our pain, God is already preparing a way to deliver us from that pain and to give us a victory. We know that no matter what we're dealing with, what our circumstances are, and people who don't know the Lord, and oftentimes I wonder how they deal with pain, how they deal with their struggles, and how they even maintain hope. Sometimes I, I don't think that they do. That's why so many lost people are so hopeless. And I just love that that as Paul is saying here, we can relate as Christians. We all go through those those times of pain, but we can recognize and know that when it feels hopeless or when it feels insurmountable, as it says here, that that is just Satan's tactic to divert our eyes and take our focus off of the Lord. But when we are able to remember that we have victory through Jesus, that we have overcome the pain already, he has a plan and a purpose to deliver us from all of that pain. Um, and we have victory in Jesus Christ. And that is just something about being a Christian that gives us that hope of knowing the truth and knowing that we will overcome. I hope you have a great rest of your day and I'll see you back here tomorrow for the next day of Everyday Faith.